up in the next few weeks, folks across the DMV will may lose a sense of peace and quiet. Experts say that trillions of cicadas will emerge in treetops, driveways, and yards across the nation. Our Haley Mylon is live in Northwest right now. Haley, we've seen cicadas before, but why is this time so different? Coming to you from the peaceful, sunny, quiet, tranquil Dumbarton Oaks Park. I unfortunately need to tell you that across the DMV, this kind of silence and peace isn't going to last for long. There is a once every two century occurrence upon us within the next couple weeks, two broods of cicadas emerging at the same time. Uh, they're loud and they, they are ugly. They're, they're loud and annoying. If you don't like cicadas so much, it's time for a road trip somewhere else. Entomologist Paula Shrewsbury at the University of Maryland says this spring we'll see a once in 221 year occurrence. Two broods of cicadas, one emerges every 13 years, the other every 17 years, rearing their heads at the same time in late April and early May. You'll see lots of these little maybe dime sized holes in the ground and that's where the cicadas are active. The emergence enticing foxes, skunks and raccoons, meaning you might see more wildlife near your home including slithering critters. Copperhead's favorite food is the cicada. Jason Freeman lives in a wooded area and says he finds copperheaded snakes come around more to snack on cicadas, and he'll be extra vigilant this time around. But parts of the DMV, such as Southern Maryland, Alexandria, and Stafford County, will see the bulk of the overlap between the two broods. Love them or hate them, Shrewsbury says the odds of being around for this overlap is significant. Most of us will not see another overlap of, of the 13 and 17 year um, cicadas. I think it's going to be a fantastic, amazing event. And for some of you, at least you may not see these bugs anywhere near your homes. If you live in a newer development, that's because the ground was likely dug up before the bugs got to burrow last time around. For now in Northwest, Haley Mylon, DC News Now.